What's up guys? Gino from the AV Pod here. I'm out in the garage today. Uh, I'm going to try and pull the baffles out of my tab performance slash cut exhaust. Uh, I ordered them. I got the zombie baffles in them and I'm really happy with them. Uh, I just want it to be a little bit louder. So I'm going to try and pull the baffles out today and uh, see how it sounds. I pulled a little screw out of the bottom and tried to pull the baffles out by hand and that wasn't working so I'm just gonna take the slip-ons off and try to beat them out that way. And a couple little taps after you take the slip on off. I just used a long piece of uh, steel I had laying around here, but tapping it from the inside and it slid right out. And this is what the zombie baffle looks like inside and I've got to admit I'm not that impressed. This is like, just looks like masking tape and you can see where some of it is burnt and torn off and I'm a little disappointed about that uh, I don't know maybe there's some exhaust experts out there that can tell me that yeah this is exactly what it's supposed to look like but I don't know so, I'm gonna do the other side and then uh, put them back on and listen to how it sounds see through it and this is the steel that I use and just in the hole and just tap it all the way around Baffles are removed. We're going to go ahead and throw the slip-ons back on and fire it up and see what it sounds like. <laughs>
the baffles out. I really like the way it sounds. Uh, I'm gonna probably keep it like that for a little while at least. Um, like I said, was not real impressed with the baffles. I mean, being wrapped in masking tape. But like I said, if there's some exhaust expert out there set me straight, maybe that's how they're supposed to be, or maybe that's typical. But uh, I really enjoy the way it sounds, and I really like tab performance and being able to pull my baffles out and whatnot. So I'll post a link in the uh, description for their site. Go over and uh, check them out. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. All right, guys. I just got back taking the bike for a test ride after pulling the baffles out. And I'm going to put the baffles back in. I lost a lot of torque. Uh, the gas mileage went to shit. So, for as good as it sounded, I would prefer to have my gas mileage and my torque back. So, something to think about if this is something you want to do. If torque and gas mileage isn't something that concerns you, then then definitely I'd recommend pulling them out, but not for me. So thanks for watching guys.